I tell you I don't know that there's many guys better to take the ball on getaway day than Alex Wood and Jacob coming off a really good afternoon yesterday two for three in RBI Jacob Young stood in there well as a solid single to start the game Joey Manessis one for four Friday not in the lineup yesterday and that breaking ball gets Joey Manessis nowhere to go Nats will have two men aboard for Jesse Winker Make that two a three, a strikeout for Alex Wood. Lane Thomas moves from the two hole in the last two games to batting fifth. Now he grounds it deep in the hole to short. Backhanded Hernays. Easy route to second, and that will retire the side. T. Willie on the bump. Trevor Williams, veteran right hander. Zach Geloff up to the plate. 207 this season. A couple of home runs, five runs batted in. Down and in for the strikeout. Trevor Williams, only his eighth K in 11 innings. He's a contact guy. This was nasty. The day they. 0 for 6 with two strikeouts in this series, 228 average. Into left. Winker gets a good jump. He'll knock it down. The runner will go for two. Throw is in time. Jesse Winker, three outfield assists now. On a ball that he kept close. Franny, he set his sights perfectly. Joey Gallo gets a start at the top of the second inning. No score here. Alex Wood on the mound. Joey Gallo is caught looking. Riley Adams. And he got him. Struck him out. Three strikeouts for Alex Wood. Looking good so far. Trey Walker. Base hit in this series. And how about two walks? Clean single up the middle for Jacob first time. Runner going. Here's Langoliers again. The throw to second is in time. And Geloff a great tag on the other end. How about Shea? It's a high throw, not necessarily off target, just elevated, and Geloff comes down. He catches Lipscomb on the elbow there initially. And there's another breaking ball down and in that hits a Nats batter. So the speed of Young goes to first. C.J. Abrams, who fly ball to center on the first one he saw. Nice. Abrams into the right field corner. Run. And the young men are off to the races. Uh-oh. Here it's comes Weber. the relay. Now they will stop. Ricky Gutierrez was sending him, and then when he got around third, Jacob Young took a look, so did his coach, and it looks like they made the right decision. Watch it as he goes down to the right field. Lawrence Butler does a great job to cut this off and get it in. Jacob Young, he takes off. Run hard until you get stopped. He's running hard, and then breaks her on up. That's how fast he is. He's able to do a slide and then keep up. Second and third, one out. Big spot for Joey Manessis. Down to third. Runner coming home. Productive out. Jacob Young with Davis playing pretty deep in the Nets by a run. Joey Manessis, RBI number three. And a big spot against the lefty for Lane Thomas now with two outs. Thomas to left center. Lane will deliver a two out RBI. Heading for third, Winker. Lane Thomas stops at first. And the Nets get a big two out stake to lead by a couple on his eighth RBI. Great job by Lane Thomas. Maybe understanding the situation more than anything. Got to expand just enough. Knowing that a lefty on lefty matchup isn't ideal for Joey. Jesse, good base running. Good inning. I tell you, this team is fun to watch running the bases. Runner goes at first. Pitch low and away. And Lane Thomas will be seven for eight this year. Real tomorrow, Vargas getting the start at second base, batting right handed. Vargas in the air to right. Lawrence Butler is there, and he will make the catch. That will end the inning, but the Nationals score two. Riley leads off top of the fourth. That ball is fair. Riley Adams circling out to second base, and it'll be his second double of the year to go with a home run. And Franny, so they say get him on, get him over, get him in. Two-thirds of that taken care of now, and Jacob Young, a good contact man, is next. Young's been aboard twice. This ball, right field corner. It is fair. He is flying to second. Good job of getting the ball back in by Butler. But the Nats add another run, and it's 3 nothing Washington. How about a first pitch changeup up in the zone? Let's put it out there in the right field corner. Getting over there, getting it in. Nice job by Jacob Young. Got to get something elevated with the infield in. Lawrence Butler again saving the A's from a, even a bigger inning, I feel like, in this moment. 3 2. Little fly ball into left field. Brown coming in, and it's actually caught by Davis over his shoulder. Wow. His back turned to the plate, flails his glove out and makes a tremendous running catch by the line. And not easy with this sun starting to peek through the clouds. But you can see J.D. Davis just kind of put his head down, take off to a spot. That's just a fantastic effort from J.D. Davis. On to the bottom of the fourth inning. The A's trying to get to Trevor Williams. He has a 3-0 lead. J.J. Bladé swinging on the first pitch. 
And that'll drop down for a base hit. Abrams moved back, but it was far beyond his reach. Two opposite field singles for J.J. Blade. So Seth Brown, who struck out swinging to lead off the second. Strike three call throws him on a heater. Strikeout number five. And the last three have all been called third strikes. Davis first pitch swinging first time. Bounced out to Abrams. And in the air to right. Lane Thomas letting Jacob Young know he's got it. And Trevor Williams spinning four shutout innings on only three hits. Top five, Lane Thomas, grounder to short and a big RBI single. Lane Thomas, a high drive to deep left center. See you later, way later, up to the concrete above that big high wall. Second of the year, RBI number nine. Four nothing Nats. Just wait on it and you get yourself a 3 2 sinker middle of the plate. Lane Thomas destroys this 106 off the bat, 429 feet. Lawrence Butler hit a ball hard to second base, ended up being ruled a single. 2 2. That one's hit even harder. Back goes Thomas. And that ball off the top of the wall. He's into second base standing up. Lawrence Butler inches away from his second home run of the year. So close. Yeah. That looks like a little slider that gets absolutely tattooed by Lawrence Butler. And just as it starts to work its way out of the ballpark, it's working its way down. I mean, that is right off the lip of the wall. Shea Langoliers up. A one grounded right back up the middle. That's going to sneak through for a base hit. Butler being waved home. There won't be a play. And the A's have scored their first run of the game. Well, that right there is how you draw it up. A great at bat by Lawrence Butler to get the inning started. Lead off double. And now you got Trevor Williams in the stretch. Going to expand his zone just a bit. But he got a pitch he felt like he could handle. A pitch he could do something with. Five innings complete here in Oakland. The Nationals have a four to one lead. And Trey Lipscomb's going to line one out into right center. On for the second time today. Second hit of the series. On base for the fourth time this weekend. Lipscomb was on the move and he's in scoring position with two outs. Joey Manessas 0 for 1 with an RBI grounder. To and Manessas off the end of the bat. Falling. And they will score for the fourth straight inning. Joey Manessas will take it. He has doubled his RBI total today. The dugout loves it. And the Nats get that run right back to lead by four again. Thomas, two for three today. Thomas, another base hit. Beauty. And another two out RBI. Have a day lane. And the Nats are on top six to one. Inside for a ball, and Toro works a walk. So the A's have a start here in the bottom of the sixth. J.J. Blade in the air to right field. Thomas moves back. He leaps. It's off the wall. Toro at third base. Blade pulls up at second and a three hit day for JJ wastes no time and that might be the spark the A's need here in the bottom of the sixth. That's JJ Blade baby drives it up the alley Thomas had a great run great beat on it he elevates just out of reach and you can see Toro he's going to have to hang out here watching Thomas track that ball he sees it off the wall easily heads on over to third base. Well here's Nevin's first AP of the day after coming in for JD Davis but Nevin a line drive into right field. Field. That'll score one, maybe two. Blade pumps the brakes. He stopped there. And Tyler Nevin, a big swing for Oakland. Lawrence Butler just missed a home run last inning. 1-1. One, one. Line drive. Base hit into right field. Another run's coming around to score. Nevin to third. Lawrence Butler. LB looking like he's wearing LV. Uh, it was just a matter of Lawrence Butler finding his swing, finding that comfort zone. I think there's just a, a palpable aggression. Runners on the corner. Shade Langoliers had a softly grounded base hit into center that scored Lawrence Butler. Oh, one pitch. That one gets away. Nevitt's coming home. He's going to score. It's a two run ball game. Well, right now, the Nats just having a tough time putting a lid on this sixth inning. Pitch down. See, just in front, not able to body up. Payoff pitch is a walk. And now Noto, who's had his struggles in this series, represents the leading run. 3-2. He takes down low. The bases are loaded for the rookie, Daryl Hernandez. The payoff. He will get it on a walk. The 
baton is passed to the top of the order. It's a one-run game. Little floater into left field. On comes Winker. He says he made the catch. He didn't make the catch. Two come in to score, and the A's have the lead. Well, with two outs to the crack of the bat, everybody was going to be on their horse and riding, and they were. It looks like that ball ends up hitting the grass. Just needs to finish one off, get that confidence up here in the eighth. Ground ball to second base, might be two. Geloff tags the throw to first. Noda holds the bag. It's a 4-3 double play. Washington is challenging the out call at second and the out call at first. And here, I think, is pretty self-explanatory. It's going to be out at first base, but this is where the decision's going to come. And it looks like he caught the bottom part of his jersey. After review, the call at second base, the out stands. The runner is out. The play at first base, the out is confirmed. Washington will lose their challenge. This guy has had a phenomenal series. Ursaig looking to change that. It kicks off of him. He recovers quickly. Oh. Rolls his glove to first. Wow. An innovative play by Lucas Ursaig. Finishes off the inning, and the defense was at a premium here in the eighth. You got to be an athlete. That's down to their final strike. The one-two pitch. Mason Miller finishes off the Nationals, and the A's win the series. It's the third consecutive series win, the first of that kind since May of 2021, and the comeback kids of the Coliseum show themselves here today. The A's win 7-6. What a performance.